YouTube, welcome back to the channel. Recently, the new Raiden Shogun story quest dropped in Genshin Impact, and we just did it over on my Twitch channel. And I've come to the conclusion that it is hands down the best story quest in Genshin Impact and probably the most saddest one. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and check us out over on Twitch. Enjoy the video. Ad Astra Abyssosk. Ad Astra Applesauce, Catherine, to you too. Recently, the Adventurer's Guild has received an unusual commission, and after careful consideration, we believe that the Traveler would be the most suitable candidate, right? Do <laughs> Autumn. Indeed, as ever. I will spare the pleasantries then. May I ask if you two are available to help? Uh, of course. That's why we're here. Well, let Honestly. me go over it briefly. Our client for this job is the Yashiro Commission. Apparently, Rift Towns are attacking the roots of the Sacred Sakura nearby Mount Yogo in great numbers. <sighs> Rift Towns? A Narukami Island? Does it have to be Rift Towns? Yes. We are not sure where exactly these creatures come from. But this time, they are attacking in alarming numbers with great aggression and a clear target. Okay. The Sacred Sakura is of tremendous importance to Inazuma. The tree. I trust you are aware of this already? I believe I understand. Good. Then you can see that this case is very urgent indeed. Is the Tenryu Commission aware? Yes, and they are already taking action of their own. However, given that the Sacred Sakura's root system is vast and complex, and faced with the unpredictability and scale of the Rift Town's attacks, they are finding it difficult to defend against them. Hmm. Their main priority is to protect the civilian population, so they are actively looking to cooperate with all other available forces to eliminate the monsters. The Adventurer's Guild is one of the key parties assisting the Tenryo Commission with their work. But so far, the combined efforts to combat the Rift Towns has failed to substantially not, ameliorate the situation. Not in saying time to make those some whelps yelp, or I'll send those pooches. I'll send those pooches packing. I'll send them packing. I'm going to send those pooches packing. You have our deepest gratitude. Your confident response puts me far more at ease. I will mark on your map the areas where Rift it freaks me out that she's a robot. Reported. I hope you won't encounter too much trouble overcoming them. Well, nah, we got this, we'll dude. Before you can say Ad Astra uh, go to the area where the monsters have appeared. Bet. Let's go do it. Uh, robot Catherine. She does say rebooting. She says rebooting an error a lot. Um, so she's definitely a robot. Uh, Daisy, welcome in. How are you today? Welcome in the stream. Do that, do that, overload it a little bit, and then we do this. Oh, I love her so much. Oh my god, big boy. Oh no, it's a big boy. Emerge. Right now. Do that. Shine down. Oh my god. Do this. Inazuma shines eternal. Emerge right here. Right now. A sight to be Oh yeah, baby. God, I love her so much. She's not powerful yet. But she's fun to play. Jeez Louise, how many supposed to fight, dude? Maybe I should not have brought this team. Oh, never mind. We did it. We got it. We did it. Torn to oblivion. Riding Shogun, baby. Let's go. Oh, you love to see it. Shogun? Wait, no. Could also be A. Okay, so A or I, however you want to say it, is the real one, right? It's you two. <gasps> right and shotgun. Uh, question mark, though. Question mark. We don't know. It has been a long time. We have not seen each other since the resolution of the Tenryo Commission crisis. It has been a bit. Okay, sounds more like A. It is you, right? You sure made short work of them. That was amazing. What are you doing here? I'm making early preparations for what's I love to her come. so much. We need a new, uh, I want a new skin for her. Last That's what time I want. We took a walk around Inazuma together. I witnessed the way the world is today. 
I was finally able to comprehend some things that I had never understood in the past. Since then, <laughs> thanks for letting me know that. I encounter an obstacle in my thinking. I find myself having the urge to spend some time in the outside world. Okay. Makes sense. You must get super bored being stuck in there all the time. Might I remind you that I am not here to amuse myself? I'm Recently, sorry. Recently, I have observed a number of changes in the external world from the plane of Euthymia. The most serious of these being the attack on the sacred Sakura by numerous rift hounds. The music is so good. My attention, so I pursued them. And they led me here, where I happened to run into you. Thank God. Uh, the voice actor pronounced I like A. Oh, so it's A. Okay, got it. The commissions and adventures can deal with monsters. If the Shogun rather than I were to discover them, yes, perhaps she would have left the situation alone. Okay. Why? Because she's just a puppet? Precisely. According to the rules I designed for her, Matters of this nature are to be delegated to the Tri Commission. But Rift Hounds attacking the sacred Sakura. It brings back bad memories of that terrible disaster. A disaster? Oh, she's so beautiful, too. Yes. 500 years ago, a great catastrophe befell Inazuma. Everything was engulfed in a pitch black fog, and monsters ravaged the land. Countless lives were lost, and this homeland that the people had worked so hard to build barely escaped being obliterated entirely. Like the a plague. Monsters committed many atrocities on Inazuman soil, and the Rift Hounds were always their advance guard. Their duty was to tear open a passage through space with their claws and teeth, and then call in even more powerful beasts. Who? 500 years ago? Conria. Hmm. So you've heard of it, too. That's an episode of history that I am loath to recall. Maybe to you, it seems like my response to these creatures was an excessive one. But an excess of caution is not unwarranted in this case. Guess he can't argue with that. Since we are both here for the same reason, let us work together. Bet, let's do it. I mean, you're already kind of on my team, so I mean, why not? From the traces they've left in the surrounding area, there should be many more monsters nearby. All of them must be eliminated. Let's go do it. I feel so safe when we're in Ace Company. Having someone uber powerful on your team kind of makes you feel invincible, doesn't it? Chat, I'm going to tell you right now. Mihoyo or Hoyoverse literally just told you right here. Uber powerful on your team kind of makes you feel invincible, doesn't it? This line right here. Mihoyo's trying to tell you to pull for Raiden and that it's worth it. After we've dealt with the monsters, we should ask her to tell us more about Conria. But we can do that. If you don't get Yai, I'll if I don't get Yai, I'll definitely pull for Raiden. Jana, 110% is worth it. Let's follow it. It should be this way. Look for the marks left behind. Oh, my bad. There they are, little footsteps. Where do these go? Up there, perfect. <laughs> Who's making these marks? Is it the Rift Hounds? I can't wait to see your final reaction of an opinion, but I will wait till you finish the quest. Okay, so at the end, there's something big. I can't wait to see that. I'm very excited. I'm gonna try to finish all of this today. Uh, let's go this. Is it going this way? Cleansing light, look for the marks left behind, bet. Oh, there's some over there, perfect. Uh, lady, welcome in. How are you? Hello, Dora. I'm a bit late, but hello, Smooch. How are you doing? I'm doing great today. I'm doing great. We got Yai last night, and now we we're doing the Shogun story quest. The damage is not too serious. The Yashiro Commission will be able to nurse the root system back to health. Bet. That's it's awesome. Stuff that's flowing out. Is it sap or something? And how come it's glowing? Yeah, what is that? Huh? Oh my god, we should not have asked that question. Oh no. Ghosts? What? What the heck? It be the first time we'd seen ghosts on our journey, but why would they appear here? Let's search the area. What the heck, Perhaps dude? We will find out. Okay. I kind of don't want to. Uh, like spirits, okay. I can't go on like this. Not when the other troops are counting on me. What happened here? 
could you tell us? Wait, we can talk to him? Who are you? Oh my god. What are you doing here? Run quick while you still can. The monsters will be back. And once you're in their sights, I'm telling you there's no escaping them. We will defend Inazuma until our dying breath. What exactly happened? You don't know? Inazuma is engulfed in darkness. <gasps> so these are the spirits from 500 years ago. The Conria Beasts thing. And horrifying monsters are everywhere. They're merciless, ferocious, and they will devour everything in their path. Every last trace of humanity's existence, I tell you. They'll do But look, none of that seems to be going on around here. Not right now. But they'll be back. Does he know he's a look, ghost? Get out of here. Now. There's no time left. The Almighty Shogun is gone. So is Kitsune Saigu. There is no one left to rely on but ourselves. I don't know how long. Oh my god, I don't know what's happening. I'm confused. But if we abandon our hope, then we've got nothing left at all. Don't worry, I'm right here. It's... the Shogun? You're back. Please, we beg you. You have to help us. You have to save Inazuma. Only the glow of your supreme lightning can dispel this terrible darkness. Please. I'm confused right Inazuma now. Inazuma will be reduced to a hunting ground for the beasts. Calm down. The war you speak of is over. Over? What do you mean? You're a ghost Shogun. of Christmas past, Kitamura. How do we explain to him that he's dead? You're not alive. Were there spirits trapped in the roots, I'm guessing? Look around you. The grass grows green and lush, and a soft breeze blows. This is Inazuma at peace, as you will no doubt remember. Almighty warlords, welcome in. How are you? There are no monsters, Facts. nor is there anything else here that could threaten your life. What? What? But, but how? Just moments ago, they were everywhere. Or is this a time travel thing? Did we just open like a little multiverse in Genshin? Maybe I'm overthinking this. Maybe I should just keep playing. I saw them tear my comrade to shreds with my own eyes. Hey, calm down. Everything's fine. Huh. I think I understand. Almighty Shogun, you saved Inazuma. Kind of. <laughs> yes, we were right to place our trust in the Almighty Shogun. As long as the Shogun is with us, Inazuma will last for an eternity. <laughs> D-Look, a Hoyoverse. Yeah, we've opened up a Hoyoverse is what it is. Thank you, Your Excellency. Thank you, thank you. What's wrong with him? I think he's disappearing? He's gone. Paimon can't even begin to understand what that was all about. But somehow, Paimon feels all sad and hopeless. Surprisingly, she doesn't feel hungry. Interesting. If I am not mistaken, what we just saw was a samurai's memory that was buried in the land. The oh. sacred Sakura can absorb and purify the filth in the ley lines. After the Rift Hounds attacked, some of this filth leaked out through the cracks in the trunk and formed a physical entity. Oh, that explains it. Okay. An entity formed with strong filth would be highly aggressive. Huh. But when purified, it presents in the form of a memory. Purified filth quickly dissipates and will be absorbed by the ley lines shortly afterwards. Okay. In other words, it cannot exist for too long. I see. Okay. So the memories of the ones that died are all appearing at this moment? That's actually kind of freaky, not gonna lie. Yes. That soldier was one of the many thousands who made the ultimate sacrifice. What he was describing just now was precisely the disaster that happened in Inazuma 500 years ago. He mentioned that the Shogun was absent. He did say that. Yes. <laughs> Inazuma was facing many great crises at that time. Some were local in origin, while others... <sighs> others came from the now fallen kingdom of Kanria. Oh. The disaster in Inazuma caused me great concern. I felt that I had to step in before it was too late. Otherwise, it would spread to all of Tevat. But my friend... 
Kitsune Saiko reassured me that I had nothing to worry about. She would shoulder the responsibility of protecting Inazuma and mobilize all forces at her disposal to combat the threat. I'm guessing Kitsune Saigu is Yaimiko, right? Maybe? I could tell that, although neither of us acknowledged it, we both knew that the road ahead would likely end in tragedy. So, hmm. Inazuma was attacked at the same time as when the disaster happened in Kanria? Indeed. Okay. Countless monsters suddenly appeared throughout all of Inazuma. In the end, Kitsune Saigu sacrificed her life to protect the people. That's so sad. I never had the chance to see her one last time. But I would like to believe that she kept her promise to me until the very last. Okay, can we just stop for a second? Yai's ancestor. Oh, okay, got you. So it was Yai's ancestor. Mentor, thank you. Um, can we just stop for a second? The voice acting is on point right now. On point. This is sad as hell, dude. I'm getting chills. Like, just listening to her talk about this, dude. But even then, Inazuma was left more devastated than we could have ever imagined. Those terrible tragedies left great wounds that are still felt to this day, both on the land itself and in my heart. Hey. Is this the loss that Yaimiko mentioned? Yes. For the longest time, I couldn't bring myself to face the pain of that loss. All my martial might was in vain. Though I could conquer Tatarigami and vanquish monsters, I was helpless against the ravages of time, powerless to keep the ones I cherished alive. So she outlived all of her, like, loved ones, you know, and... Dude, that's sad. But that's, like, super tragic. After my clash with human ambition, I thought long and hard. Now I realize... I cannot fixate on the past forever. So you're no longer stuck in the past. When I traveled around Inazuma with you, I caught a glimpse of how the nation has progressed over the centuries. A glimpse of human potential. Everything far exceeded my expectations. Moving hmm. forward inevitably invites further loss, but also new encounters. Just think of wow. that soldier. Despite all the losses he had experienced, he still chose to keep fighting for the sake of moving forward. Right. All those who sacrificed themselves back then gave their lives fighting for a future. But perhaps the future they were hoping for is not the eternity that I once strove for. Well, well that's what being human is about. As Inazuma's god, it is high time I honored their wishes. Warriors of the past who spilled your blood on this land. Your noble souls now rest in this earth. I will never forget you and all that you did for Inazuma. He's taking all this pretty hard. I mean, yeah, it's like super sad. <sighs> Come on. Let's keep investigating the damage to the sacred Sakura. Let's go do it. Uh, it's not here. It's over here. There they are. Wait, where's my team? Oh, I have to. Oh, okay. We gotta play as Ren Shogun. All right. Or I. Sorry, I gotta get used to that. I gotta start saying I more. Where's my team? I'm gonna die. Can I please have the rest of my team? Maybe? I'm about to die. Um, okay. I, a, I don't know. I gotta, A. I have to keep, I have to remind myself. Okay, cool. And I like how my, my A is like almost dead. Something seems wrong with A. A, okay, A. 
Gotta remember that in my head. A, A, A. Are you feeling okay? Why would you ask that? Because I care? I don't know. Well, usually you'd pull out your sword and swish. Vaporize them all in one go. No? You are unduly concerned. I'm simply conserving my energy. <gasps> they did that on purpose. That's why she was weak. Okay. Although I have some understanding of the situation already. Huh. It or was it, how does it play a part? At any time. I must be prepared for anything. If there are more formidable monsters lying in wait in this area, I must make sure I have the strength to face them. Please. Ah, I don't want you dying. Heads. Spoken like a seasoned shogun. The roots seem pretty badly damaged this time. We definitely need to tell the Yashiro Commission about this. Hey, the same light is leaking out again. Oh my god, there's another memory? Nick, welcome in. How are you? Furuyama? Who's this guy? Is that you? Hmm? Almighty Shogun, what brings you back so soon? I thought you were off fighting a battle in a distant land. Fighting a battle in a distant land? Sounds like this guy's talking about 500 years ago, too. <sighs> yes, Paimon. <laughs> like, yes, these are memories. Come on, we gotta keep up with the Paimon. Um, I think it's cool that A can talk. I almost said I. That A can talk to these memories. Like, we can talk to these memories, dude. Allow me to introduce Furuyama. He is a tea master and a member of my retinue. Okay. Though blind, Furuyama is unparalleled in his ability to appraise tea. He brews some of the very finest tea in all of Inazuma. Okay. Your Excellency, you shower me with praise undeserved. I have simply had the good fortune to be in Your Excellency's presence long enough to become acquainted with all the skills that are required of me. Coffin, welcome in. Okay, chat. So far in this Archon quest, the voice acting is literally on point. This guy sounds amazing. A sounds amazing. Like the voice acting is so good right now. It sounds like the almighty Shogun has brought a guest. I'm afraid I'm unable to serve you any respectable refreshments on account of the current situation. But please sit and rest. Okay. After all, it's quite a mess out there. Um, what should we do? Let's just go along with what he says. Oh, um, yeah. Sheesh. There's monsters everywhere out there. It's pitch black and loads of people have been injured. <laughs> Imagine. I see. So they have fought their way this far already. Most of the, the man is blind. We could have lied to him. Escaped. They wanted to take me with them, but it seemed rather pointless to me. So I decided to stay. And now the almighty Shogun is here. I have even less reason to run away. <laughs> I already left for Yama. Even the almighty Shogun was powerless to resolve. Where could I possibly run to then? How come you're not panicking? People flee out of a desire to live on. And the desire to live on stems from a feeling of having unfinished business in life. Oh my God. Oh my God. Did you just hear what he said? That was like super deep what he just said. People flee out of a desire to live on. And the desire to live on stems from a feeling of having unfinished business in life dude bro Uriyama, what a poet but me i have no such thoughts and i have no regrets i love Uriyama. protect this man at all costs the almighty shogun often speaks to me about her dreams over tea just listening to her stories ah i've been blind for many years but her vivid descriptions took me on a splendid journey to all the most beautiful places in Inazuma. Over time, I've come to understand her mindset. Hmm. Quite the romantic at heart. A true dreamer. Oh, A's a romantic. Okay. One thing she always says is, good things don't last forever. Everything changes, fades, disappears completely over the passage of time. And so, people must make the most of the life they have, seize the chance to enjoy it while it lasts, and have no regrets in the end. 
Not Hoyo versus like being super deep today in this Archon quest, dude. Like when you listen to what they're saying, bro, it's so deep. This TED talk is amazing so far. That doesn't fit the definition of eternity at all. That doesn't sound like A. So you see, as bleak as things may be now, I have experienced countless wonderful things in life and have no reason not to be satisfied. I mean, it's a good way to live, dude. Perhaps you are right. It won't be long now before I have to say goodbye to the almighty Shogun for the last time. Ah, what a pity. No! I'll never get to see what Inazuma looks like after the almighty Shogun rebuilds it anew. Get this man new eyes, please. Let's unblind him, please. I love him. But I suppose Best character so far. Everyone says that Inazuma has turned dark now. But to me, it went dark a long time ago. God damn it, Ryama. Once this catastrophe is over, life is sure to spring forth anew. But even if I survived until then, I'd probably be a hopelessly befuddled old so-and-so by then. <laughs> so, I love him. never mind, eh? <sighs> Oh, goodness me. Speaking of befuddled, look at me rambling away to my heart's content and forgetting to serve the tea. You're not alive. The almighty Shogun comes to visit and I don't have the tea ready. A truly egregious loss of decorum. One moment, I'll just... Hmm? Where in the world is the tea set? You're dead. I hope the others didn't smash it to smithereens in their hasty departure. Here. Really? But it's always been right by my side. Goodness gracious, what a fool I'm making of myself. I love him. I couldn't possibly have my guests fetch it themselves. That would be most discourteous indeed. He's so nice too. Don't worry about it. Take a rest. We'll be back right away. Almighty Shogun, you're not going too, are you? No, no, no. Your humble servant implores you, not with the war raging outside. This place is complicated. It's quite unlike the tea house in your memories. Leave it to us. But Let us well, be nice okay. to you. I never thought I'd see the day that I need the almighty Shogun to personally collect my tea set for me. I can't decide whether it's a final regret or a final stroke of good fortune. <laughs> I love him. Hirano, where's the tea set? It's the Traveler. And the Almighty Shogun. How might I be of assistance, Your Excellency? I wish to borrow a tea set from the Yashiro Commission. Oh, uh, sure. I'll fetch that for you right away. Right now. Uh, please step into the courtyard and have a rest, Almighty Shogun. Oh, and I'll inform my lord about your visit immediately. Ah, and the tea set. I'll bring that here as soon as it's ready. Go. Be at ease. I'm not here to see Commissioner Kamisato. Actually, I'd prefer to spend this time chatting with the Traveler. Please, fetch the tea set at your convenience. Uh, no, no, no. What a I nice lady. Servant. I daren't think of my own convenience when the Almighty Shogun graces me with her presence. I'll deal with it right away. Bet. Uh, uh, Pava, welcome in. How are you? And we Zamex, have a welcome in. Chat. I'm sure you must have a lot of questions. I do. First and foremost, are you single? Uh, was it really you that the tea master used to serve? Right. Paimon wanted to ask that too. The almighty shogun that he described didn't sound anything like you at all. I seldom had the time to drink tea. <laughs> Any free time I had was spent practicing martial arts. Oh, so she kicks butt, dude. So, in the vast majority of cases, the one he made tea for was the former Electro Archon. Oh. Who was also my sister, Raiden Makoto. Her sister, Raiden Makoto. He may well have had an inkling about there being two Raiden shoguns. Uh huh. But he always acted as if he was completely unaware of it. The philosophy of life that he shared with us just now, that was Makoto's view on reality. She always saw things that way. So it was her sister. Oh my God! Didn't you know, right? Yeah, I knew. I knew that. I knew that she had a sister, but I didn't know that like he he was talking about her, her sister. I didn't know that until just now. I knew she had a sister though. That is so. Oh, I need more lore on her sisters. She has a couple, right? Had pretty different views, huh? 
Indeed we did. It was the biggest difference between us. In her eyes, the most precious things in this world were dreams. Mm -hmm. The yearning for a better future held by living beings. Dreams, or in other words, ambitions. They are similar, but not identical. When you came charging into the plain of Euthymia, I saw human aspirations light up the sky far above in the form of countless stars. This somewhat shook me. <sighs> Her voice actress, dude. So good. So good. Now, it seems like she was right. While I took the wayward path. So you're like more of like a realist, right? Wow. There sure was a lot going on beneath the surface. Makoto saw a bigger picture than I did. In her view, a dream is more imaginary, more abstract than an ambition. <laughs> an ambition is a yearning for something material or a concrete outcome. <laughs> it is finite in nature and will be replaced by a new ambition in due course. Makoto was more concerned with the force that drives humans to constantly generate new ambitions in the first place. It is something innate, rooted in instinct. In other words, it is something eternal. Dude, the writing in this Archon quest, like this makes me excited for the future of Genshin Impact. And as story quests go on so far this is the writing voice acting like i know we've already i keep repeating myself but it's just that good the voice is on point top tier story and god tier level voice acting that's uh, quite a lot to take in put it simply makoto wasn't concerned about outcomes mm -hmm. i didn't understand at the time how can we say that we are maintaining eternity when things are constantly moving forward and evolving? Right. I suppose what it comes down to is the definition of eternity she set out with. It seems more in line with how humans view the world. Yes, it does. <laughs> I always thought that she must have grasped some elusive, arcane wisdom to arrive at the conclusions she did. Mm -hmm. But in the last analysis, Makoto's philosophy was, on the surface at least, an elegantly simple one. Notwithstanding that it was also the more prudent choice, based on a more mature, far-sighted outlook. I wish we got to meet her sister, dude. For real. I wish we got to meet her. Do you feel you're starting to understand her better now? You have already witnessed my previous views on eternity. But now, I no longer cling to what was lost. Hmm. I suppose that means our differences have been reconciled. Hundreds of years after, though. Mighty Shogun, I found a tea set. This one in particular should be fit for your excellency's use. But it's quite beautiful. Thank you. You are too kind. A humble servant such as I does not deserve the gratitude of the Almighty Shogun. It's all good, sir. She's actually pretty chill. <laughs> Imagine, yeah, she's actually pretty chill, you know. Let us return. We ought not keep Furuyama waiting too long. Adventure time. Here, have that. Uh, good question. So we don't know both. Okay, so we don't know. <laughs> hey, where'd he go? He wouldn't have gone looking for a tea set himself, would he? I mean, I wouldn't put it past them. Or perhaps the ley lines did not have the power to sustain him for very long. We were too late. That was the case with the memory we saw earlier. Oh, no. So, so we won't get to drink his tea? No. We didn't even have a chance to say goodbye. <laughs> the information held in the ley lines is complex and disorderly. Uh-huh. Hang it, dude. I wanted to see him again. To begin with, was a miracle of fate. <laughs> Cheer up, Paimon. Well, this chance won't come often, and we do have a tea set. Having tea? Perhaps I should try my hand at making us a pot of tea. 
Hell yeah, I will never say no to tea with A. I've watched Furuyama brew tea on many occasions. I doubt I should have any major problems doing it myself. It's like a little date. <laughs> a brews piping hot uh, pot tea. Okay. The tea is ready. Please give it a try. So many thoughts were racing through my head as I was brewing it. I... I'm not sure how to explain it. You don't need to. I understand. You're right. But the things we've seen today have brought back many memories for me. I've been reminded of many people, too. Kitsune Saigu, Makoto, and all the other friends who I watched pass even further back. Mm -hmm. Back at the Yashiro Commission, I kept the conversation reasonably lighthearted. But now... I'd like to broach a heavier topic, if I may. I don't know if I'm ready for that, but... Sure. The events of 500 years ago not only robbed me of my friend, Kitsune Saiku, they also took Makoto away from me for good. She died in that disaster too? Yes. She went to Conria alone without telling me. Oh. Unlike me, Makoto was no martial artist. Whenever similar crises had arisen in the past, I was always the one to face them in her stead. But this time, the circumstances were so grave that Makoto had no choice but to leave me behind. Or... Perhaps it was more that she went ahead of me, put herself in front of me, so that I would remain hidden. In any case, by the time I realized what was happening, yes, it was too late. I arrived only in time to hear her dying breath. Bro, I'm getting chills in my body right now. I'm literally getting chills in my body. This is like so sad. She had already lapsed into unconsciousness by that point. So all I could do was enter into her mind. As far as you're concerned, it would be somewhere similar to the plane of Euthymia. Mm. It was there that we bid each other a final farewell. I cried bitterly. Even in those final moments, I couldn't understand her actions. Tepe is still the saddest story. No, f Tepe. I'm sorry. Like, literally, I love Tepe. This take... I, someone asked that question earlier, right? This is the new saddest one. Hands down. I can't think of another one. Why did she go to Conria first and not I? Why did she keep me in the dark about it? Was it to shield me? It was there and then that I resolved to pursue eternity. As a testament to that decision, I saved her realm of consciousness just before it collapsed completely and brought it back to Inazuma. It's hmm. quite a story. When I returned to Inazuma, I was shocked to find that a great sakura tree had appeared on Mount Yogo. The tree that you know as the sacred sakura. Yeah. That's exactly what everyone back then told me as well. That it had existed since time immemorial. Uh huh. They were so matter of fact about it and couldn't at all understand what I was so surprised about. No one questioned it. And yet, its presence contrasted so starkly with the area as I remembered it. It seemed as if I was the only one to have noticed it appear suddenly out of thin air. Okay. In the end, I simply had to accept that it was a miraculous effect of Makoto's consciousness. So, like, the Sakura tree is Makoto's consciousness? With the help of the uh -huh. sacred Sakura's power, I was finally able to overcome the monsters and quell the disaster in Inazuma. This is all really hard to understand. Kind of beyond Paimon's level. Simply put, 
Magato's power somehow made that tree appear. Yes. She had such a great love for this land and for its people. In this respect, I still do not compare to her. I once told myself Dang that it. I would never speak of these events again. Facing the fact that she is gone is unbearably painful. But even the tea that is most bitter to the tongue, once swallowed, leaves some sweetness in the throat. And it's time I came to terms with it all. Um, while we're on the topic, since you experienced that battle in person... Have you seen my sister before? Sister? Hmm. I had heard that you were looking for your family. You mean to say that she was somehow involved in the Conria disaster? I don't know. Based on what we've learned so far, it seems so, yeah. I'm sorry. Does she? I wasn't there for the whole thing. By the time I arrived, the worst of the fighting was already over. Did I miss a key point in the Archon quest? And also... My mind was consumed entirely with the plight of Inazuma and the fate of those closest to me. So, I am afraid I can't help you. Okay. Oh, well, that's a shame. But it can't be helped, I guess. Boy, huh. both of you have experienced great tragedy. With this last cup of tea, let us honor the tea master's memory. For Furiyama. Thank I you, miss him already. Destiny. For giving us the chance to meet again. We should go. Let's keep following the traces. Observe. A cup of tea has been left for Furiyama. How much did he actually perceive and how much did he let on? I miss Furiyama, dude. This Very story nice. quest is sad so far. so far. Be dark if our sister killed Mako. Don't say that, right in Impact. Do not say that. That'd be so freaking sad. Oh my god, that'd be horrible. Uh, wait, where am I going? Okay, let's go back here. Oh. Uh, where are we going? Oh, there it is. Perfect. Got it. Found it. I must have forgotten. Okay. Dude, the plot thickens. Where does this go? Is it down here? Wait, hold on. What? Okay. Oh, it's down here. Perfect. All right. Okay, there's more dogs over here, and I don't want to fight them right now. All right. Please leave them to me. Okay. Something's wrong with her. Fighting is what I do best. God, she's the one of the best characters in this entire game. You can't tell me otherwise. Shine down. A is one of the best characters in this game, hands down, and this quest is making me love her even more than I ever have loved her. Illusion shattered. Inazuma shines eternal. Come here. Chat, if you do this quest. And it does not convince you to pull for for A, for Raiden? I don't know what will. I'm going to be honest with you. Like... Are you what is... Right? What was that? Wait, I'm what? I... <laughs> Did you see that? <laughs> okay. She just got frozen. That was so weird. Torn to oblivion. All right. Oh my God. There's so many. There we go. I got kebabs, baby. Why do I keep getting frozen like this? Is this a glitch? Shine down. Or is that supposed to happen? Okay. I'm just going to say that was a glitch. That's kind of weird. Illusion shattered. Inazuma shines eternal. Hey, that was a pretty good burst. 44,000. I wonder what, why do I keep getting frozen like this, dude? Oh my god. Oh, it's supposed to happen. Oh, got you. Hey, maybe you should leave this one to us. You don't look too I... good. My 
apologies. What's happening Don't to you? Don't worry about it. Just take a breather and get your strength back. Okay. Who? Welcome back in. We'll deal with the monsters. I got this, baby. I got my own. My own ride and show gun. Look, that's the same light again. Time for another trip down memory lane. Hey, we got soldiers to help us. Where am I? Who are you? Uh, Almighty Shogun, you're here too. Are you injured, Your Excellency? Yes. <sighs> Kill the dogs. I'm quite all right. Just feeling a little stiff. We, the Shogun at Samurai, will defend the Shogun until the. Have you very cried end. yet? Oh, uh, hoot, hoot. <laughs> I'm gonna tell you right now. Uh, I was feeling chills in my body. It, this is the saddest quest ever, and I. I have so much more appreciation for, for A now, honestly. Still not convinced. Stitz! How dare you? You just want to be different. <laughs> Come on, men. They're coming back for more. Let's get them. Don't. It's too dangerous. Danger is our duty, ma'am. If we were the kinds to shy away from danger, we never would have taken up arms to begin with. Facts. No need to worry, almighty Shogun. When the situation looks bleak, we will draw on the power granted to us by the gods. Is that a vision? It certainly is. I know the gods are omnipotent and their willingness to grant their power to humans means they have high expectations for us. What? If the almighty Shogun is in trouble, now of all times is the moment for us to honor that. Yo, that's cool. So that's how samurai of that era understood visions, huh? Interesting, so full of hope. Nobody knew where your excellency had gone, and we were starting to despair. But now we've found you. You're right here with us. Dude, these guys are sick. Just the sight of you appearing before us once more has reignited the hope in our hearts. This hope is the light that I will love guide them. us out from the darkness. Dude, get some friends like these, dude. Everyone the last samurai. Me. We'll help too! Huh? Affirmative, but watch your backs. Don't worry, I, I got this. I fight a giant frog all the time. <laughs> Protect the Almighty Shogun. Let's go, baby. The birds come. Emerge right here, right now. I'm always watching. Woo, buddy. Remove all obstacles. Now you shall perish. There is no escape. The wind knows. Right here. Emerge. Right now. There we go. That was sick. That rotation I just did was perfect. That was a perfect rotation. That was awesome. It seems like their attacks are finally over. Oh, dude, this quest is so good I've so far. Never fought so fiercely before. Thank you all. Um, Something's definitely wrong okay? with her. Maybe you should keep resting. I'm fine. No, you're not. I feel much better already. You fought phenomenally. It was truly awe-inspiring. Yeah, I know. Monsters will definitely come back. And when they do, it'll be more than a few rift hounds this time. Ah, oh, we got it. Quickly, escort Her Excellency back to Inazuma City and regroup with the General's forces as soon as possible. Dude, Fujiki is sick. I like him. sees the almighty Shogun safely returning, their spirits will be lifted. Also like Fukami. He's a cool guy. Well, what are you guys going to do? We will stay here and guard against the monster's advance. Bet. We cannot afford to let them get any further. Dude, these three guys right here, homies. Homies right there. Arms. As long as we stick together, we can face any number of monsters that come our way. Let's do it. I hope. They're going to be gone anyway. We have no business disrupting the reality they are experiencing. Just leave it to us. Fighting is what we do best. You got it, the dude. The almighty Shogun is the only one of us with the power to change the present state of affairs. Only Her Excellency can turn back the tide of despair and lead us onward into the future. No matter what kind of threat faces Inazuma, we will always place our faith in the almighty Shogun. <gasps> Thank you all very much. The real homies, baby. I promise you that I will create a bright future for Inazuma. I should not have left it this late to make this promise. But from this moment forth, know that I shall be true to my word. Don't worry, Your Excellency. We will never doubt your word as long as we live. With you leading us, we will claim back everything that Inazuma has lost. 
Glory to the Shogun. Glory to the, Glory to the Shogun. Whoa. Is that a promise to them? It was both. The people's sacrifice has always caused me immense pain. But in dwelling on the tragedy, I overlooked their splendor. The grief blinded me to how brightly they shone in their final moments. The result being that in the centuries since their sacrifice, I have dishonored their will. You could take the view that whatever I say to them is meaningless, because they are but disembodied memories held in the ley lines. But even so, they are due a resolution. I owe it to them and to all the people who have placed their faith in me to date. Well, Paimon thinks that even if it's a few hundred years later, you're doing right by them now, and that's what counts. Thank you for your comforting words. But this is my basic duty as Inazuma's Archon, and I have neglected it for far too long. Mm -hmm. I used to think just like that samurai. That I was first and foremost a warrior. And my only duty was to face whatever challenge came my way. But what Inazuma needs more than a warrior is someone like Makoto. Even though I am utterly unlike Makoto and can never become the person she was, I still need to do the things that she would have done. So she thinks that her sister was like the better one. Humans are worthy of your trust. Yes. They are. They are strong and resilient and have much to be proud of. As the Raiden Shogun they revere, I should not be the one to hold them back. Well said. Sounds to Paimon like you figured it out. He's figuring it out slowly but surely. Change will come to Inazuma and with it, new possibilities. This will take time, but eventually, the future will bring healing to the scars of the past. Harder. No matter how long it takes, I hmm. am committed to bringing hey. this to fruition. Oh, I keep this saying I. This is my promise. Now that we've dealt with the Rift Hounds, this matter is halfway resolved. It does not appear that the threat will escalate for the time being. Hmm. I will leave the Tenryo and Yashiro commissions to handle the follow-up work, such as investigating the origins of this incident and tending to the root system. If I have any questions, I'll let you guys know, okay? I appreciate you. She seems to have changed a lot since we last met her. What's wrong, eh? Come on, keep up. What's wrong? What's going on? Are you feeling unwell again? Something's going on with her, dude. My body. I can't move it. Was that why she was freezing earlier? It looks like the situation is more serious than i thought we should get you back to the city no need she is calling me the time has come what can you help me walk yes i got you i need to go to the cave Below the Grand Narukami Shrine. Why? What's in there? Paimon right now is not the time for questions. Also, they messed up right here. This should say Paimon and not A. A battleground. One where I shall sever ties with the past and take the first steps into the future. Huh? One where I shall sever ties with the past and take the... F okay? Um, okay. I'll, I'll take you there. Let's go. This thing? What's this? And then I can go through the barrier? If this rain keeps up... Thank you. Thank you, chat. We're finally here. We did it, baby. Let's the go. Entrance should be nearby. But I should work on my Sakura tree. I, I, I know I should definitely do that. <laughs> Thank you guys for let, helping me with that.
I was where we're gonna have to stop. <laughs> Big brain chat, dude. Without chat, I don't know what I would do. Whoa! Where'd that Tory gate come from? That's a scary looking gate. Are you alright? Uh, it's getting worse again. But it's fine. I'm happy. I'm about to put an end to it all. Okay. This is a place I once sealed off with my own hands. The entrance to Raiden Makoto's realm of consciousness. Uh, it looks like she will no longer allow me to do with this body as I please. Huh? What are you talking about? And who is she? Makoto? Your sister? <sighs> Follow me. Should I bring a good team, chat? Let me know. Should I bring a good team? Where we go? <laughs> it didn't allow me to pick one. Oh my god. Yes? Okay, bring a good team with me. So not my current team. Uh, oh my god. Dizzy. You don't use them? Do not for this? Okay. This time? Whoa. This place. Oh my god. It does look like a plane of Euthymia. Look. Look over there. It's another A. That's the boss, dude. That is the the new boss. We meet again, traveler. Ah, this is Raiden Shogun. That's A. This body is an assistant to the one within, but it is also the guardian of the rules. Should the one within wish to stray from the rules, this body shall stand in her way. Oh my god. Wait, Paimon knows that voice. Is that... I'm about to throw hands puppet? with this puppet, dude. You have wandered the realm in my body. And you appear to have grasped the true essence of eternity. You believe your present self has greater certainty than your former self. Thus, you believe your present self is correct. Don't you? But have you really been enlightened with new ideas? Or have you been degraded by irreversible erosion? I'm here to show you my answer. We are both warriors. Well, do it. And the dialogue we must now have shall be conducted by the blade alone. Uh, oh my god. Wait, wait, wait. The atmosphere in here just took a turn for the worse. Uh, are, are you... Uh, <laughs> Bye, are you dude. all right now? Uh, are, are, are you good? The this? discomfort I was experiencing earlier was caused by the Shogun rejecting my continued use of her body. So the puppet doesn't want you to use her body. She wants to keep you trapped. I'm trying to wrap my head around this. As she indicates, once I started entertaining the idea of change, uh -huh. I became hostile in her eyes. So she, oh, okay. But inside a realm of consciousness, I exist independently of her. She cannot affect me in this way. Oh, okay. Though she is a puppet, the Shogun has her own consciousness too. When necessary, she appears here to confront me. I think you've mentioned this before. Uh, Paimon gets that everyone has their internal battles and stuff, but <laughs> not like this. This is a little bit different, it's Paimon, time. okay? Hey, Shogun with the Shogun? <sighs> Never thought we'd see that day. Oh my god, this is gonna be a battle of the ages, baby. Let's do the it. Rules I'm ready. Are set for the Shogun are. No. The Shogun herself is the manifestation of my past ideals. Mm -hmm. The very foundation stone of eternity. It shall not be easily swayed. I would not try to change her if it wasn't necessary. Isn't there any other way? Can't you... Just talk it out? <laughs> Just talk it out. No. A is someone who... A isn't someone who leaves herself an escape route. But Yeah, but in different ways. My form is a symbol of supreme majesty in which has been vested power over all the realm. Oh my god. It is the cohesive embodiment of all that constitutes the Raiden Shogun. It inherits A's pain. The pain of inevitable loss that comes as she moves forward. Mm -hmm. So too does it inherit her determination to reach eternity. 
Okay. Sick, welcome in. How are you? Every action undertaken is for the sake of resisting erosion. Determination. Courage. Love. Hatred. All of these will be degraded and distorted by the incessant flow of time. Only rules shall remain constant for eternity. Those were my thoughts when I created you. Now, they are towering obstacles that I have no choice but to overcome. You oh, man. make yourself my enemy? I am your past, the everlasting law, the guardian of eternity. And I am she who promised a dream to her subjects. Oh my god. Side and A. Let's go chat. In the end, even the proud and mighty only maiden was cut down in the script. Oh my god. Not the music. The real blade has been cleansed of her blood and filth. Never shall it shine as bright as Where'd you go? Ooh, 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 ooh. Oh my god. Shine down. Oh, that music, baby. Okay. Inferior. She dodges the burst, bro. Oh my god, what does that do? What does that do? What does that do? What does this do? Oh my god, I'm gonna die, dude. Oh, I'm gonna die. Yo, she hits hard. Oh, oh, oh my god, I'm gonna die. I am going to die. No, run. Lightning falls on the land what does that of do? Oh no! Oh, I'm gonna die. I shall not fall here. We got healed. Never mind. Dude, I wish she had like that ability. Not you dodging me. Oh. All right, I'm glad that they were. She's healing. No, stop healing. There's plot armor. Oh my god, she just recovered, bro. Oh my god. Eat your kebabs, dude. She's like insane. Stop. Oh my god. Stop. You're insane. She's a psycho. Stop it, please. Oh my god. Illusion? What is this? Clones? Shine down. One clone down. Oh, I got an achievement. Sick. Oh, you can still hit her. Perfect. Hey, stop that. Dude, the music is insane. I wish I could keep healing. You hit so freaking hard. Stop it. I'm at 500 health. You're so close. You're almost dead. You're almost dead. Come on. Stop healing! Am I doing something wrong? Carlton, welcome in. How are you? Am I doing something wrong? Not that music. This music's a bop, dude. Just phases. Okay, thank you. Dang, dude, you hit hard. Where'd you go? Jeez, this face is not fun. Get wrecked. I did it. I only died once, but they gave me plot armor, okay? Oh my god, that was so it cool. Appears your martial prowess has not dulled. No? But how what do you think I am? Your will remain strong. How the heck? Oh my gosh, surely the Shogun puppet isn't invincible. In this realm of consciousness, 
Her existence is tenacious indeed. She was built to resist erosion. Mm -hmm. Her will is stronger than any other living beings, including you and me. What? Then, does that mean this is gonna be a never-ending battle? <sighs> Maybe. But I have to prove to her that my present will is no product of erosion. The future I shall forge will be a grand undertaking. One that will be resistant to erosion. If I don't do okay. this, the Shogun's rules can never change. Mm. And Inazuma can never move forward. This is my duty. No matter how long this battle may last. Months. Years. Centuries. Centuries, jeez. And no matter how many times we must fight, I will defeat her. What will happen to Inazuma in the meantime? 500 years ago, humanity proved their strength in battle. Here in the present, Shogun is a badass, dude. To challenge wayward practices, tear them out like the diseased wood of an old sakura tree, so that new, healthy branches might spring to life in their place. It is about time that I learned to trust them. But can you l bear to leave humanity to go alone? I understand that. But if the dreams of which Makoto spoke are true eternity, a short moment for which the Shogun does not exist is nothing to fear. Oh, dude, I love A so much. I fight for the everlasting future of Inazuma. However long the battle may last, it is but a drop in the ocean of eternity. I vow to the subjects of Inazuma that I shall one day return. Gosh, she's so this badass looking, dude. my oath. Please, be my witness. The way she stands there with that sword. Oh, I need that as like a wallpaper. During my absence, I place everything in Miko's hands. Pass on my words. Okay, I'm sorry. What happened? So she's going to stay there until she defeats the puppet version? Looks like we got kicked out. Oh, what do we do? Are we really just going to leave A and the Shogun to keep on duking it out in there forever? No, we got to do something. It's making sense. And maybe this is the only way to change the Shogun's rules, but... A has no physical body anymore and has to rely on the Shogun. Right? Also, A can be pretty stubborn at times. Yeah. And has a history of rushing into difficult situations. What if she gets too obsessed with winning and she forgets why she's there in the first place? She it banned us? <laughs> and then she might never leave again. We're not about to leave her just yet. Yeah, we should help her out like we did last time. Yeah. The quicker she gets through this, the better. Let's do it. Anyway, Cut down how long she needs to spend in there, or you know, help her win the fight. Well, whatever. Um. We can't let anything bad happen to A while she's in there. Oh, but we also can't get in there anymore. Okay. How do we turn it back well, on? First things first, we gotta find a way back in. Oh, come on, brain juice, don't feel time on now. <laughs> brain juice, um, I love her. Okay, maybe if we both ran into it at the same time, really, really hard. We should probably go talk to Yaimiko. Oh, you're right. Let's do that. <laughs> Let's go do that. Who knows if she really understands these consciousness realm plane thingies more than we do, but there's no one else we can turn to. Uh, all right, up the mountain we go. All right, let's go talk to Yaimiko, okay? <laughs> oh my god, don't leave us, eh? What's up, Yaimiko? I'm also Yaimiko. Someone's not in the best of moods. Hmm, oh, there she is. You're all tangled up in another situation and need me to unravel it for you. I mean, well, when you put it that way. I hope you realize how lucky you are. If it was anyone else, I don't think I'd have the patience to keep greeting them with a smile after the first few times. Ah, see, we got a, we got a sweet spot for her, dude. But you're always smiling. That was a figure of speech. Do you understand? <laughs> Nitpicking my turns of phrase. Mm. The sheer audacity. <laughs> I love her. I'm glad we got her because I forgot how funny she is, dude. She's just like, huh, the audacity from this little fairy. Oh, yeah, yeah. Something really big happened. It's a she, she. You tell Yaimiko about everything that has happened. Oh, okay. I see. 
So, Ace decided to palm Inazuma off on the humans, while she goes off on her own to fight a fierce battle that doesn't even have an end date. I mean... Yeah? When Yai Nico says it, it's... She's got a point. I'm like... <laughs> Impossibly stubborn. <laughs> Jumps straight to the most extreme course of action imaginable. Presumes her sheer will can see her through, mm -hmm. despite a near impossible goal that requires nothing short of the very peak of her abilities. <laughs> yes, that sounds like A, all right. Dang, you don't have to like psychoanalyze her. Yeah, I, okay. You know you help as well as I do that she's always been like this. Why start fretting about it now? This duel is more serious than anything up until now. Rushed into it without thinking. <laughs> well put. Oh, she acts like such a child sometimes. She's so sassy. So you seem to be under the impression that I am able to offer some sort of help? Who gave you that idea? A. <laughs> she did. playing dumb. She's doing this on purpose, for sure. I don't know. Uh -huh. You're learning, little one. But really, the truth of the matter is that I don't know much more about Raiden Makoto's realm of consciousness than you do. Mm -hmm. All I know is that it's the foundation of the sacred Sakura. And from what I've heard, it's a little different from A's plane of euthymia. Mm -hmm. Because Raiden Makoto is no longer alive? Not just because of that. The nature of the space itself is different in some way. But I can only speculate. You're the ones who have actually... There was really no there. difference, I don't so think. tell me... We needn't worry about the details too much. It'll just be a little difficult to explain things later on. That's all. Okay. First things first. Follow me to the entrance. I will follow you wherever you want me to go, Yai. Okay, I guess it stays open. Uh, let's see. I wish I could get Yai maybe next time on her rerun. Hopefully. I mean, I got her. I'm very yeah, happy then. I got her. I always have my ways. But she'll always, she'll get a rerun of eventually, you know? I need to be. To the outsider, the realm of consciousness is a very abstract concept. Mm -hmm. Luckily, I'm A's familiar, so I can sense her rough whereabouts. In other words, even though I can't pinpoint the exact spatial location of this realm, I can still send you to where A is. Bet, let's do it. So, and I'll fight the, uh, the boss. But it has a location, but you don't know where it is, but you can still send us there. What? Paimon's asking the real questions yes. here. No need to try and understand it. Let me put this simply. Right now, she is surrounded by chaos. Everything is turbulent and disordered. Mm -hmm. If you try to force your way in, you could be swept away by a giant wave that sets you down in an unknown corner of space-time. What? This is precisely why when entering the plane of Euthymia, it's much safer if you place your consciousness in a physical object first. Okay. What? <laughs> All right, well, Paimon, stay here then. You two can go in. <laughs> in your dreams, Paimon. Suit yourself. Worst case scenario, all we stand to lose is A. So what's the big deal? The more I play this, um, the more I'm happy that I got AI yeah, because like uh, her personality, dude, she's just so sassy. Like, well, I'm, well you know. You don't go, all we'll lose is a life. We'll lose A. I guess that's fine with you, Paimon. Oh my god. I love it. Well, <laughs> I love it so sure. much. Then of course. Now I shall send you on your way. Let's do it. <sighs> so this is where I have to bring a, a good team, right? I say. What is oh, it? Oh, nothing. It just seems extraordinarily chaotic, that's all. My suspicions have been confirmed. By the way, remember to focus constantly on your heart oh, not? Okay. wishes when you enter inside. Okay. Only a strong enough will can prevent you from being swallowed by the giant waves of abstract space. Only if you are strong enough can I deliver you to the right destination. Okay. Well then, the door is open. Hop on in. I'll Just stay outside on and provide what stability I can. I'll be ready to respond if anything happens. Okay. I'm placing my god in your capable hands. Uh, YCA, welcome in. How are you? Did this last night? I was stunned. No spoilers, but this was an amazing and deep, and others were stunning. Oh. <laughs> 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 
This is the multiverse of some sort? Hoyoverse? Remember to focus constantly on your heartfelt wishes when you enter inside. Oh my god, dude. Only if you are strong enough can I deliver you to the right destination. Dude, this cutscene is sick. Oh, mm, my God. God, when are we getting a Genshin anime? Hoyoverse, give me a Genshin anime. Give me a Genshin anime right now. Let's do it. How can this be? You have returned. But how were you able to get back in? And how come you have not changed at all in all these years all these years wait this is some wibbly wobbly timey wimey stuff right here so she's been we just saw her like a couple minutes ago but for her it's been years that she's been oh my god this is a duel to remember it is as if we have returned to the moment when the laws of eternity were first established your will today is as strong as it was back then. Oh Over my God! Countless battles, not once have you lost, and never have you shown the slightest hesitation. Had I made all enemies of eternity stand against you, you still would not have wavered. For your firm commitment to enforcing the rules, you have my admiration too. You bring oh honor God. to the title of Guardian of Eternity. Now these two return once more to this space. <laughs> An inevitability of fate, perhaps. Then, let this be our final duel. The conclusion to oh my that God. which began 500 years ago. The final duel. Final duel? <laughs> so you're finally willing to stand back, traveler. Are you going to put an end to all of this? I'm going to be the start of something new. Oh my god. The time our jewels took to fight was long. I'm almost to dead. The rise uh, never mind. Of <laughs> oh my god, that's the new form. Dude, Breaking that looks so cool. Alright, alright, chat, we got this. Alright, dodges. Jump over it. Oh my god, what is she doing? This is horrible. The music is so Dude, the metal music in the background. I will the battle music is so good. Witness the final calamity. Who's this? In oh, the electro? Oh, it brings. the best this is the best archon quest in genshin impact so far this has been the coolest one i'm about to die please i don't want to die this boss fight is so freaking sick dude what does that do oh my god jump it jump yeah oh no i'm gonna do <sighs> I don't think you can die, can you? Or does it... Can you die in this? Or will it not allow you to die? Oh my god. <gasps> Only one way to find out, I guess. I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die. I'm at one health. Okay, I don't think you can die. Which is good. But I'm still gonna try not to, like, rely on that. I need to recoup my my stamina real quick. Stamina management, baby. Dark Souls 101. <laughs> oh my god! I didn't know you could do that. This is the coolest battle music. This is so sick, dude. Jeez. I need this on vinyl. Get that, get that, get that, get that.
This is so sick! There is no escape! Run, run, run! Okay, we dodged it. Perfect. I don't know what you're doing. Leave me alone. What are those hands doing? Oh my god, this. Okay, I don't think you can die in the story quest. That's good to know. I have to figure out her moveset, though, for when I... Because she's a, she's a new weekly boss, right? Or like a world boss? Got it. Got it. Let's go, baby. I dodged them all, baby. Oh my god, I didn't dodge that one. Okay. What are you doing? Oh my god. Shine down. She is a weekly boss. So she is, this is a new weekly boss. This boss is sick, dude. Inazuma shines eternal. In illusion shattered. This is a sick boss, dude. God, imagine we got that as a skin. Shine down. There is no escape. Ow. Now you shall perish. You dodged it? Oh, how dare you? That was so rude of you to do. Calamity. Illusion shattered. Plot immortality. Thank God they did it, because I would have failed like five times already, dude. Without that. This is so freaking cool. You're about to go down, baby. That was so cool, dude. This is the end. You have won. Believed you were incapable of transcending the past. But it seems my belief was baseless, and I underestimated your spirit. But a will that cannot be eroded has no way to embrace the future. You need not worry about the future, and you aren't alone. I know your power more than anyone else. Had I relied upon my strength alone, I would have lost this duel for sure. Yet, my reason for fighting redefined my martial prowess and redrew my limits. God, she's beautiful. I now carry the gaze of the myriad of expectant eyes that look to the light in the heavens. And whenever I think of this, I feel something stirring within Muso Ishin. Mm -hmm. The blade that I inherited from Makoto seems to be trying to guide me, to encourage me. I noticed it also. Just now, in the heat of battle, it seemed to unleash a new and unfamiliar power. This power is beyond the limits of my understanding. This blade belonged to Makoto. Perhaps it can only respond to me with its full power when I truly understand and believe in her. Huh? <laughs> when I clasped Muso Ishin in my hands, I had the feeling that she was by my side once again. Oh, it was at so once cute. a familiar feeling and a strange one. Makoto barely wielded a blade in her life. And yet, her blade brings me closer to her. You have my approval. Your present will is not the product of erosion. I shall no longer stop you from attempting to modify the rules. From this day forth, this body will remain your assistant. Hey! I won't design any more rules that can never be changed. You used to represent my past, but from today onward, you are me. Makoto never saw me as a fearless weapon. Likewise, I should not regard you as a mere tool. Huh. You truly have changed. I suppose this is what humans call growth i understand i shall become your shadow just as you were once makoto's shadow the duties i perform will not change but as a warrior i look forward to the chance to fight like this again in the future hmm <laughs> do you say this because you have not yet reconciled yourself with your defeat it was simply a new experience for me 
One that is worth reliving. Have you finished fighting then? Like, for real this time? Hmm? What's that sword doing? Hello, A. And greetings, those who have come to bear witness. Wait, what? Her sister? Oh my god. I am Raiden Makoto, the previous Electro Archon, who failed in my duties and left you all to pick up the pieces. <gasps> Makoto? Fuck, dude! No! Oh my god! I'm so happy. You've come so far. I always knew he would make it here in the end. I left a faint fragment of my will in Muso Ishin, so that in the moment that you unleashed its full power, I too would be released. <laughs> oh my god! A convoluted way to reach you, but... Well... You held such deeply entrenched views at the time that you wouldn't have listened to a word I said. There was no time to wait for you to have a change of heart. Please forgive me. All I could do was find some way to wait until you came to me. Bro! But... You never mentioned this to me. Everything happened so suddenly. I'm sorry. I've always felt terrible for having to entrust Inazuma to you all of a sudden. I should have been the one to impart these ideas to you, a little at a time, to dissuade you from your pursuit of stillness. Did you know what was about to happen in Conria? I had some sense of it. That place... was not somewhere that any Archon could afford to ignore. In my present form, I can no longer perceive time. I don't know how long we have been separated before this reunion, and I don't know what Inazuma has experienced in the meantime, but I know that this must have been an extremely arduous journey for you. And I'm sure you must have wanted to shed tears many times along the way. Yeah, yeah. Don't look down on me. <laughs> See? You admit it. It was with this possibility in mind that I left a parting gift for you. Something to soothe Inazuma's pain. Here, take it. Before my last shred of consciousness fades away. But it is you who must take the most important step. tree that blesses the people in this moment new to the world and yet to be known when to plant it where it shall bloom she who brings it into being must let her heart and dreams decide grant it life eh is this is it really Eternity extends time into infinity. Dreams illuminate each moment within. When both shine in unison, the sacred Sakura blooms from the darkness, finally free from the clutches of the heavenly principles. Now the nightmare has dissipated, and reality is made whole. The vision we both yearn for is still further ahead. My only regret is that I cannot witness Inazuma's future. Nor can I walk this journey with you. <sighs> Do you know, A? I am so happy right now. Because <laughs> my final wish has now come true. Oh my Your god. Your cool arm once protected me from countless calamities. For this, I've always felt indebted to you. Though I could never repay you in full, this sacred Sakura will buy you some time until you are ready to awaken and embrace the new. What do you think? Did it do the trick? <laughs> this time, it really is goodbye, eh? <gasps> what the fuck? 
Dude. Goodbye, Makoto. Oh my god, dude. How was this game a free-to-play game? How? So the A of the present planted the sacred Sakura in the realm of consciousness, and it took root in the Inazuma of the past. Yes. No matter what you make of it, it's quite incredible. The emotional damage I am feeling right now. Chat. I'm gonna get close to you real quick, just like this, okay? YouTube, if you're watching. This is the best Archon quest in Genjin Impact. This is hands down the best that I have experienced so far in this game. How are they going to, like, what's next? Like, that wasn't, what? Turkey, I don't give a f whatever quest whatever yeah your conquest i don't care turkey it's a quest shut up for a second it's amazing don't ruin it it's, it's the best quest and you know what it's better than any of the archon quest there you go there you go all of this is thanks to Mako's oh my god power. her understanding of eternity is much more profound than mine it's amazing Eternity is a concept intimately connected with time. When you begin to touch on eternity, the concept of time becomes murky. I saw wonderful things inside that place. Time was moving forward and backward at the same time. A place where time is meaningless and cannot be understood with ordinary logic. Huh, so that was the turbulence I was sensing. Perhaps that is the reason why you were able to return precisely to this point in time without any problems. They just pulled time travel on us, dude. Yet, that sense of disorderliness has now completely disappeared. I don't fully understand yet. But my intuition tells me that the reason for everything, it's that seed. Hmm. Well... I'm not convinced that it was Makoto's power alone. I don't know. Don't take this away from Makoto, okay? Because she did work. Perhaps Makoto got a higher power involved in all of this. But whatever the explanation, her solution is what saved us all. Right. Without the sacred Sakura, Inazuma would likely have been completely swallowed up centuries ago by that disaster and the filth. Facts. I know you've always perceived there was something special about the sacred Sakura, but to me, it has always been there. That's the thing that confuses me right now. Because apparently people were saying that it was always there, but then like, it only appeared to A, like, at a certain point, like, and I don't know. You've tried in the past to prove to me that there's a connection between the sacred Sakura and Makoto's consciousness. But unfortunately, you never did persuade me, did you? Okay, Yai. First and foremost, I love you, but zip it. Do not take this away. I saw what I saw. I experienced what I experienced. But I understand why now. It was because the sacred Sakura hadn't even been planted then. Um, but don't you think that tree looked a lot different than how it does now? I don't know, Paimon. It's all confusing. It's all timey-wimey time travel stuff. The sacred Sakura is within my purview at the shrine, so obviously I get to prune it exactly how I like it. Ugh. Now we see who's pulling the strings. I'm joking. That tree has been through a lot since it first sprouted. We have the loving care of Kitsune over the ages to thank for how it appears today. And obviously, I played my part, too. Okay, it's not all about you, Yai. It's fair to say that very little time passed between the moment you came out of that realm and the moment you re-entered it. But in that same time, centuries of battling took place on the inside, did it not? Traveler, if I'm guessing correctly. 
You were repeating your wishes to yourself in your mind, weren't you? Dang, why is she so condescending all of a sudden? She's kind, she's kind of condescending here. I am I wrong, chat? At that time, I could sense A's whereabouts, but I also sensed anomalies in the flow of time within that space. Suffice to say, time added a whole new dimension to our search. Simply establishing a location was not sufficient. Fortunately, your will was strong enough that the turbulence carried you to the moment in time most likely to be the intersection of all that you were wishing for. Okay. The flow of turbulence may well have been influenced by Makoto, but it took everyone's efforts combined to ultimately help A. So this time, it looks like thanks are due to you. Does that mean it wasn't by chance that we ended up at the final duel? It was meant to happen. We were always meant to be there to witness what was going to happen? Dude, this is cool. Yeah, we're supposed to be there. I thought that the flow of time was the same on the inside and the outside. So it was a great shock to me when the traveler reappeared. My first thought was, has a great disaster befallen Inazuma? But it turned out you had come to rescue me. You came for my sake. Oh yeah, we love to you. Help me reach the best possible outcome. You too have my thanks. You have done much for me, and I will never forget it. Hey, how are you feeling now? My body has fully recovered, and the Shogun's will no longer fights against me. I feel like her voice is a little bit different now too. Always thrilled to hear you're in good health, but I was really asking about your emotions. Have you managed to calm down? After all. You saw Makoto in there, didn't you? All right, Yai, let's cut the condescending tone real quick. This is touchy stuff. Like, Yai, right? Yai, please. Like, oh, after all, you saw your dead sister in there, didn't you? Hey, Yai, zip it. All right, you're not that hot shit, okay? I know you're the new five star. Guess what? Everybody turned their back on you. Last second, they were like, you know what? I no longer want to pull for you. So you're not that special. Boom. Boom. Roasted. And you can't even function properly without a Raiden Shogun on a team or another electro battery for you. Cool your jets. Yai yeah, Miko. I only heard her voice. Don't hurt my I don't hurt my Raiden, dude. <laughs> I'll be fine. It brought a few things back, of course. But I've made my decision to move forward. I have to say, this has reminded me once again just how brilliant Makoto was. She predicted all the ways in which Inazuma's future could unfold all the way back then. She even factored my immaturity into her plan. It's all thanks to her that Inazuma lived to see this day. I just planted a seed. Your will and hers were both indispensable. Yeah, it was thanks to everything you did that you got to see her again. Yeah. Amazing. Just because the cause and effect ended up a bit back to front. Thank you. Today, at long last, you and Inazuma finally emerge from the shadows cast by the events of centuries past. Makoto and you are Inazuma's past and future, and both are indispensable. It's rare to hear such comforting words from you. I graciously accept them. Now kiss. <laughs> oh, come on. You only think it's rare because you never used to listen to a word I say. Makoto said the exact same thing. A is a stubborn person. What can you say? <laughs> Great minds think alike, hmm? I wonder. Does that qualify me to maybe... Take the position of Shogun for a couple of days? <laughs> this face. I need this as an emo. Just like, no. Actually, no. Forget that. Far more trouble than it's worth. We will have to end the frivolities there. There is much work to be done. The Shogun and I will closely review the Inazuma of today to find out where things currently stand. Then, we will give careful consideration to the future. After that... <laughs> I will abolish the Sakoku decree. Really? That's, That's big. Huge news. I am no longer pursuing an eternity defined by stasis. Uh huh. In which case, there is no further need to keep the nation under lock and key. 
I don't doubt that many challenges lie ahead for Inazuma. But out of those challenges will be born new opportunities. I'm looking forward to it. And that's the story quest, right?